name's John Risky, president of uh, Local 167G out of Grand Forks, North Dakota. We have 1,100 members. They're in harvest. They're they're in beet harvest for crystal sugar. We get up to 1,300. So we have crystal sugar members are are a company that our members belong to is out of Drayton, North Dakota, East Grand Forks, Minnesota, and Moorhead, Minnesota. And then in Grand Forks, we have the North Dakota State Mill in with us. And then we have in the southern part of the valley, we got Mindak Sugar, the members there. And then we also have the Lute Superior, all the elevators that load the barges and take the grain in and, and distribute it there are in with us also. What we're doing is uh, we're just setting, get a lot of leaflets out at the factories, handing it out at the guys at the end of shift, and then we're also uh, going to do a mailing this week of some leaflets out to our members, and we do some phone calling and, and go out and door knock and pretty much get the call up the officers and have them get to the people, have them get out, get the word out. Last Friday evening, we had a, what we did was we coordinated with some. We had steward training. We were international came in and gave some steward training. And after the steward training, we got the stewards and and officers came out and we um, split up in groups of two and and we had seven seven groups that went out and did some door knocking through Moorhead. We went through our members and the first part is we ended up handing him our political directory through the president. We gave him 760 employee free choice cards and uh, so we're still, that was just what, what we got. We're still out on the floor having the guys go and sign more cards for that. What I like to say is be part of history. This is something that um, you're going to be telling your kids about and your kids are going to be telling your grandkids and, and when you do talk about it, say that you can say I was part of it. I was out there door knocking. I was making calls. I was talking to my neighbors and telling them just be part of history. Get out there and, and vote for Obama. And